we're at the multi-specialty research hospital getting ready for our focused ultrasound treatment. Uh, the patient has a central tremor on both sides. Uh, it's a little bit worse on her left side, but she's right hand dominant, so we're going to be treating her left brain and right hand today. Uh, the tremor affects her a lot. It affects writing. She can't write at all. It's not legible. Uh, she has difficulty with eating and drinking, and of course anything she needs to use her hands for. She even mentioned she had to give up her job uh, as a waitress because she couldn't hold the plates and cups and trays uh, to bring them out. So we'll get started in a little bit. We'll place the frame, uh, and then we'll test her as we do the treatment to make sure that we get rid of the tremor without causing any side effects. All right, so then we'll go back to our unlocking our coordinates. And we want to be more lateral, so we'll go to 13.1. If we move ourselves one millimeter over, so I think that's a good spot, we'll lock that. Good. She felt a little bit dizzy on the last one, but this is about the same power. And it did push power. back to 57 rather than 59. Sorry. Okay. Here we go. All right, well this is terrific because she's gone from not even being able to draw here at all, just scribbling all over the spiral, uh, to being able to go around it with minimal tremor. Our goal is to get this result with two sonications, but if we don't get it right away and it looks like we can make small movements to make it this good, no big deal uh, to get such a good result that she'll be able to live with for years and years. I've already noticed such a major difference. It's, it's pretty amazing. No, I've never been good with explaining how I feel, but it's absolutely amazing. I think this is a great example about how being in a care team like we have here at the multi-specialty research hospital is critical. And you could see her smiling, you know, when we were testing her writing, you could tell she wanted to just keep on writing now that she could do it. Uh, she was, you know, crying tears of joy at having the tremor gone and knowing all the things that she'd be able to get back to.